Hey everybody, Scarlet Steam here, aka Dyke 14 here with one, one more interesting piece of activity from the Dragonborn community. Here in Glacial Cave, up on the northern coast of Solsta, hiding in the back of a cave, you'll find this guy's skull. And after you use it for an unmarked quest, you gain a power or allowing you to summon him. Um, it's been said that, that you can only summon him up to three times, but it's unclear whether it's in general per day, a per set amount of time, um, but he's supposed to be one of the toughest enemies in the game. And so we've been upgraded to dragon bone armor and enchanted it, it ourselves. And with a vest array of abilities, we are going to do this marked, I mean unmarked quest before we take on the amazing Ebony Warrior. Because, let's face it, it's bound to help. And for some reason it's frozen. And great, we'll be right back. Okay, sorry about that, fo oh, folks, but we are back after a minor crash issue, Ooh, and we are continuing on with this minor quest to get us the power to summon one of the most fearsome and potent enemies in all of Skyrim. The game, not the continent. From said game. Now, if things get too difficult, the difficulty will be lowered, because this guy's actually supposed to be fairly tough. Kill them all! Kill the midget monsters! So far, I've only been able to build slash rebuild hold about two who dragon bone weapons, the sword and the hand axe. So that should be enough at least to get us there. Whoops. Should have checked to see what shout I had equipped. We need more souls. More, I say, more. And bam, ran right the face. 
or at least I'm assuming it hit him in the face. Why would an ice door need to be picked? It's weird. Even for this game. You watch it. Oh, these will come in handy. Oh, <laughs> that little guy scared the crap out of me. Die, you little midget gremlin goblin things. Ooh, a chest. I don't remember this. This being here, or my first time through, through this dungeon. Huh, an Ebony Mason shield. Question is, can I afford the carrying capacity? Mm, it's not really worth it. I, plus, I got plenty of money, so it's not like I need stuff to sell. to the courtyard. Okay, first, let's make sure everything's ready.
Yes. <laughs> yes. We did it. Now for victory. <laughs> there you have it for hoax that is, is the unmarked quest uh known as summoning hang car stay hey egg egg one of the toughest enemies added to the game him and that at was the quest only on that was only on apprentice so there's also adept expert and master so you can imagine how difficult it would have been. <laughs> so yeah. Huh. When we come back, whether it's an entirely different vi video or, or after a little iteration break, heck, we shall f face the mighty Ebony Warrior, uh, which is supposedly the hardest, bar none, the hardest enemy in the entire game yet. So until then, and stay frosty. Some ice puns intended. <laughs> okay, fo folks, here we go. Oh, this is the moment of truth. If I have just fast travel oh, to about the center of Windhelm, and there he is, is the infamous Ebony Warrior. So, yeah, let's get this party started. Now he supposedly carries a set of the most powerful ebony armor and weapons in the entire game. So what I'm going to do is first save and see if we can pickpocket his potions off him because he is said, at, at least according to the wiki, he to have a 5 health, magicka, and stamina po potions. I apparently have no chance to steal oh, from him. Okay, okay, okay. 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 Close thing thing to the air is this uh, excavation site, so roughly. But since I'm not sure how much time has passed, and we want to be able to have every possible advantage we can, and we'll quickly wait one set of 24 hours so that we can for sure be able to use Dragon Aspect.
And while all, all the weight it counter things kind of, I'm gonna quickly go to the restroom. Okay, I'm back. Okay. And yeah, let's do this. Also, the Ebony Warrior versus the Pope. Oh, perfect opportunity. If we can kite the dragon close enough for me to be able to fast travel or something, ain't. I can use Ben Will and ride into battle on a mighty dragon. Here, dragon, dragon. Here, boy. Come get your tasty Dovahkiin right here. All nice and chewy. <laughs> Come on, what's the matter? Don't you want some? You want some? Huh? 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 Okay, ho hopefully that dragon's still there. <laughs> also, according to the wiki, he he has a weapon of some sort. I believe it's a bow, bow that can paralyze the dragonborn, and he knows at least one dragon shout. And according to the wiki, there is no lore-friendly or unlore-friendly explanation as to why he is able to. Oh, this is my chance. Who? <laughs> See how he likes this. Dragon Rider. Tame and ride five dragons. I'll share that on Facebook later. Fast travel? Oh, a warrior. Attack! That shot won't work on my dragon.
Now, Odaving supposedly useless in this fight. He's right there. Dragon, don't hold back. So apparently, hey, you'll have a pretty good advantage if you happen to run into a dragon. Hagen, after at least stealthily sneaking up on him and discovering the location, then you can mount a dragon, fast travel, oh, and proceed to kick his ass. You know what? A real Dover King would stand and fight. So now that we at least got a steady advantage. <laughs> Sorry, dude. Food. Fall. Fall. False summon. But hey, at least you guys get to see him. And that's not nice. And now to teabag the tallest red guard and NPC in the game. <laughs> oh, it's funny. Wait, is this thing fighting us now? Holy crap, I think it is. I guess you will get to see a Kerstag in action. That's right, no one can beat the Dragon Boar. No one! You know what? We should fall. Who throw the other corpses off the mount? Off the cliff or that? <laughs> It didn't work. Oh well. We probably at least... Oh no, we didn't... Fusro his corpse off. 
Oh, oh well. Well, there you guys have it. And like I said, tell me which set of heavy armor you want on this particular character of mine. And, and to wear or during the next DLC. Including in the Ebony Warrior's own armor. Which I will more than likely upgrade. So, oh, until then, I will see you all later on our next epic journey. Hey. Hi-ho, our...